Youth with a Flame is a ministry that was started in August of 2009. It is a missions trip for high school students. We as an organization have three main goals we desire to accomplish each year. First, we want to teach the students what it truly means to be a youth living out loud for Christ while encouraging them and strengthening their relationship and walk with Christ. Secondly, we desire to make an impact in the lacrosse area by being the light of Christ. Lastly, we want to show the students that missions is not just going overseas or going to another place, but it is their city and their neighborhood, which is their mission field. The directors of YOF desire to see the changes started on the missions trip to become a permanent transformation in the students' lives. Therefore, we meet throughout the year on Sunday nights to continue building relationships. The nights usually contain a time of fellowship and food, reading and studying of God's Word, prayer, and worship. The directors desire to stay connected with the students during the year and help them with questions they have, pray for them, and encourage them in their walk with Christ. And over good is These nights will occur one Saturday a month where the students will split off into guy and girl groups. The women leaders will take all the young ladies and the men leaders will take all the young men and do an activity that will build relationships between leaders and students and also student to student. These nights are also important for encouragement and to open up honest communication and tackle the issues that face both young men and also the young women in a safe environment. This is a time set aside to focus primarily on a certain aspect of our spiritual walk, i.e. prayer, worship, evangelism, study of God's Word, and many others. It will be a two-day retreat, normally taking place on a Friday or Saturday. The students would come on a Friday night, spend the night, and then leave the next night. It is a time for them to get away from the world and focus on what God desires to reveal to them. It is a time to sit at Jesus' feet and listen to what He has to say. I will praise you. These are days for the students to come and fellowship with one another. We could do anything from hiking, swimming, grilling out, bonfires, mini golf, and also some longer trips including Valley Fair, Noah's Ark, things like that. This is a time for the students to do activities in a safe environment and also show them that Christians can and do have fun. This is another opportunity for relationships to grow between leaders and students. When we grow together, walls fall and trust and lines of communication open. Look at this. You think that this would be strange because it's a pancake. Right, it's a blueberry pancake. And peanut butter and jelly. But it's not. It tastes pretty good, actually. For one purpose, I am here. A time where the YWF leaders can spend very personal time with the students and building relationships while discussing many struggles the students are going through. This is a very intimate and personal time where the students can be honest and real and allow themselves to be loved, rebuked, convicted, and encouraged through the Word of God. The one-on-one -on -one times include leaders taking students to coffee, breakfast, lunch, dinner, ice cream, etc. The YRF leaders see this part of the ministry as the life source for growth in the students' lives, showing them that they are valued and that they are worth our time and money. Oh, Jesus. 